I just, I just feel so good right now. Anyways, hey guys, it's Sunday night. Um, it is one o'clock in the morning on the dot, literally. Wow, look at that. So it's 1 a.m. I just poured me a glass of wine, which I did a bit of ASMR for you guys, but I never pressed record. That's the only thing about this Sony ZV-1, like when you press record until the camera is fully on, it won't record. So yeah, I'm drinking the same wine that I always drink. So one, I'm a night owl, that's why I'm up. I haven't been going to sleep until like five o'clock in the morning. So I'm just in here getting a few things done so that if I want to do something tomorrow, I can. Not that I can't do this stuff in the morning, but I don't wake up early enough to do that. So my room is a dis disgrace right now. So all of this stuff that's in this pile right here, this pile right here is clothes that need to be hung. They're clothes that I got in like packages from hauls and stuff. I'm gonna go through with the stuff that I really like. I'm gonna keep and stuff that I could do without. I'm going to either a give to my little sister b let my friends go through the pile c donate all of that is trash i just opened all my boxes broke them down i need to i don't know how the ikea bag turned into a trash bag because it was holding important things but yeah that's neither here nor there and then i started going through my hoodie closet because i told you guys i had no room for all of this junk over here so i need to figure out how i'm gonna make this into um a clothes and hoodie closet like i feel like this closet was so aesthetically pleasing at first because it was oh there go the hiccups it was all jackets but yeah so i think what i'm gonna end up doing is migrating only tops over here so like tops from this closet and then these are all the jackets and hoodies that i don't want or that i don't feel like i grab as much of um I like them and I would wear them but I don't wear them as much as those ones so most of these black ones are like designer so like um it's like my leather jackets right here what is this my Saint Laurent hoodie vitamins hoodie um this hoodie is from my friend Al on Instagram you might know him Al Willis and like my blazers when I had a job, uh, Alexander Wang, more blazers, my essentials hoodie. These are like my favorite throw on jackets in the fall. Yes, I pulled my nail polish off if you see that. Um, my denim jackets, I got rid of a lot of denim jackets. And then just like hoodies that I like to throw on, all the gray ones are back there. So let me show you guys the other closet. Oh, so then this is all the laundry that I did this week. So I have to fold all of this. And then all the stuff from the Fashion Nova haul that you guys are going to see is well you guys might have already saw it it's also on here so yeah i just need to put all of the stuff on hangers and just move it i washed my makeup brushes because you guys know i want to do a makeup video but i was like let me clean my brushes like let me be dedicated this is a book i got for harper from target today first grade here i come um that stuff i have to take back but yeah so this closet as you can see the shelf is slanted I also think the pole is slanted because there's so much junk on here. So I'm hoping that by the time I migrate um, the shirts over there, everything will be okay. So I'm going to do that and I need to fix my shoe boxes because as you can see, they are like pushed back and stuff because I can't always reach them. Yeah, that's just what I'm going to do. I'm not going to film it or anything because it's so late at night. I'm in here watching Beyonce Black is King. I didn't see it yet. I'm not really watching it. Um, I'm just listening to the soundtrack, which I already enjoy uh, when the movie came out. But Beyonce is Beyonce. Beyonce can do no wrong. Visuals are always on point. Creative directors always on point. So yeah, I'll show you guys when I'm done though. But I think for the most part, I am only going to move tops over and then leave like dresses and skirts over here which is going to throw off my equilibrium when it's time to get dressed but it's whatever all right so i just want to do a quick update because wow it looks even better in my closet than it did before and i thought i was organized at first well this closet is now my favorite so let me show you so basically what i did was i took all the tops out of this closet so now it's just bottom so it's 
like sweatpants, well, not sweatpants, but like my leather sweatpants, my one pair of leather sweatpants, um, slacks, jeans, trousers, this little trouser section. Um, these actually have to move because these are skirts. So it goes jeans, pants, um, shorts, skirts, and then basically all of this is like two-piece sweatsuits, sweatpants, sweatshorts, and stuff like that. Um, and then this is like white sets. Like I have a lot of white sets. So they're in here. And then it goes to white skirts. And then from here, from the black, is basically all dresses. So I basically just put it into compartments. So dresses, two-piece set skirts, regular skirts, pants. So I like the way this looks so far. Um, that way if I go, oh, I want to wear a dress, I just go over there. If I want a skirt, go over here, X, Y, and Z, rather than before. I just had everything completely color coded. I found all of Harper's uniforms from last year. So I'm going to make sure that I go donate those tomorrow just because school is starting. And I know kids that are going to head back to school this year eventually, they will get some use out of those because she didn't wear a lot of it. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go take those to the donation place tomorrow. And the pile over here keeps growing. And I just pulled all my hangers out so that I could do that. But then this is what this closet is looking like right now. So. I need to figure out where I could put this drawer at. This is where me and Harper's mask are. Um, I just put them there so that they're easily accessible. I have like OCD when it comes to this. But yeah, there's battery sign, so let me hurry up. Um, so yeah, so now it's just all tops over here and jackets. So yeah, it looks really nice. I like the way it looks so far. It was already in order from the last closet. So long sleeves, short sleeves, tank tops, X, Y, and Z. So yeah, I'm gonna go finish organizing. I will show you guys everything once everything is hung up and this camera's dying anyway. So the wine is hitting, the hookah is hitting. It's lit. I'm feeling productive. I feel like I'm getting back on my game. <laughs> yeah so i'm just laying here now i literally just climbed in bed it's the hand for me like this is crazy but yeah so i'm just gonna finish my last glass of wine because you guys saw i drank the whole bottle i was in here having the time of my life just listening to music i just i don't know sometimes i'm just so like nah am i high strung i might be high strung um i'm just like such a serious person and i let a lot of a lot of things bother me and build up that sometimes just drinking a few glasses of wine I just really relax like literally like my shoulders relax and everything whereas I'm usually like a super tense person a super not I'm not a serious person but I just carry my stress and stuff in my body so drinking wine definitely is great to me um just because I just feel more at ease. So yeah, my wrist is killing me, but that's okay. Hola, happy Sundays. <clears throat> Let's try that again. Hello, happy Sundays. So it is Sunday, obviously. Um, I just got out the shower. I was gonna put on some cute PJs, but I kind of think I just wanna be naked. <laughs> But at the same time, I don't know. I've honestly been naked for like the last three days. Literally, like I just refused to put on clothes. So there's that. But I am about to do my nails. Um, I'm about to do my nails because I picked off all my polish because that's what happens when you have bad anxiety. So yes, I just got the shower. I just pulled my table out so I can set up my filming for tomorrow. So that way because I'm gonna have a good day tomorrow. Monday is going to be a great day for me. Monday is going to be so productive. Um, so I'm gonna set up my filming station tonight before I go to sleep because yeah, I just got some shit to get done tomorrow and I'm not gonna let my anxiety and my emotions and my sadness get the best of me any longer. Like I've had enough, I'm over it. It was, it was cute. It was cute in the beginning crying and shit and it was cute being all down and sad and feeling so lost i'm over it i've had enough um i can't do it anymore i am not gonna let my emotions get the best of me 
after tomorrow or after tonight so tonight is my last day to soak in my misery and tomorrow is going to be a great day so yeah i've been feeling really insecure lately as well but it's what i Good morning. Today's Monday. I'm in a good mood today. I like I'm on track to my normal self. I'm so high. I just ran up and down the steps three times because I went down there to fill my water bottle up. Did that. Filled my water bottle up. Came back upstairs. Then for, remembered I had packages. So I went back downstairs with my packages. And then I came back upstairs. And then I realized I needed trash bags to put the donation stuff in a trash bag. In my trash in a trash bag. And then I saw a scale. And like a dumbass got on the scale but yeah i look crazy i just got out the bed i just put my pajamas back on guys you know your girl has been wearing pjs so yeah i'm feeling really good my energy is great today um so i am gonna film a video in a little bit trying all new makeup trying over here about to break i mean over here about to fix something that's not broken because it's nothing wrong with my makeup regimen but here I am trying things for y'all. So I got packages. I'm just opening them really quick for you guys. I look crazy. I don't have any earrings on. Breaking one insecurity per vlog. You know? So I'm so hot. Oh my God. Like, wow, it almost made it in the trash. So I picked up a new phone case. <clears throat> you guys know I always use the clear, clear one. But I picked up a new one because I picked up a new one because I don't know. I feel like I just was over the square a little bit. So I went marble this time. And my mom has the marble one and hers is super cute, but she has the smaller phone than me. And I was like, hmm, maybe I'll try marble. But I still have my clear one. It's right here. Um, I just always take my case off sometimes at night because I feel like sometimes if my hands are oily or something, my phone will just be slipping and sliding and not having no grip. But I love the square cases like when you're in a bed and you're on the phone and if you just lean it up against something it sits you know so yes i got that i picked up another one of my pills just to have as a backup because i don't know i just started the bottle that i had but i just wanted a backup because they do go out of stock a lot so yeah and then the last thing i picked up from amazon 
um, was a watch thing. So I could take the links out of that new watch you saw me get. Usually I could take links out of a watch with like a, a box cutter. But that one they were so far in that I needed the whole thing. So I got this. It's only like $10. Imagine being so lazy that you just buy the kit rather than taking it to somebody at the store to do it. I guess I, I don't feel like dealing with people. You know, I'm making progress. But I'm not ready to talk to people yet. So yeah, so that's all I got from Amazon. And then I got some stuff from Boo Boo. Let me show you. Wow, this is trash too. So remember from my booty haul that I like the rib stuff so much. You know I had to go back on the site and get everything else that had the word ribs in it. So that's exactly what I did. I paid for this stuff, obviously. Um, so I picked up all the bras and panties on the site and I'm so excited because you guys know one I've been saying I need panties for like the last month and I had still yet to go and then like every time I go on the Victoria's Secret website to buy panties it's very it's a very lackluster experience they only be having like six pairs but I need like 20 so I don't waste my time I don't really like the stuff on Savage X Fenty just because I rather wear you guys know like the seamless panties from Victoria's Secret they're my favorite and Savage Fenty's like more like lingerie colorful stuff I just rather have a hundred pair of black panties I don't care if you do think I have the same panties on every day they're not but yeah so I picked them up in like the black chocolate mm, the chocolate it's gonna give me vibes it's gonna give me vibes mamas i think it was like it's called mocha on the site see so yeah, like i picked up the bralettes um i picked up like the actual bras and oh this one is ooh, put this on my body now this one is not like a rib this one's like a smooth rib skims could never and it was like four to six dollars per piece skims could never okay um so yeah i just picked up like all the th they're all thongs which is fine i don't i don't mind thongs if they're in a material like this but when they lacy and shit no it sounds like it used to they be hurting i just i'd rather go draw this than just to suffer so yeah i just picked them up in every color so so cute like this one's really cute like this mauve oh they're so stretchy too i mean i knew what the material was but this this stuff feels better than the um the regular rips the other the like these bralettes i guess because these are bralettes like they're thick yeah these are like way thicker to hold you in a little bit more but the panties are so soft they feel so comfortable um and then other colors i got were sage y'all know i love me some sage you know i love me a good sage piece so yeah i got this one and the panties and the bra i basically bought everything everything yeah so I had like all the thongs. So it was like three different types of thongs. I don't know what the difference is. So I just got them all. And then the bralettes and the bras. So yeah, I picked those up. So yeah, I'm going to sit here and whiten my teeth. I'm going to finish washing my show really quick because I have been sucked in. Has anybody else experienced this thing on Amazon where they turn on a series and it's so good. But it's like voiceovers in American on like German and shit shows like is America not producing TV shows anymore. But yeah, so the TV show is called The Rain sucked in i'm in it to win it right now so yeah i'm on season two there's three seasons um so yeah i'm just gonna do that and then i'm gonna go film so i will come back on camera when i'm done filming and yeah i wish i could go like run my, go run my errands later while my makeup is done so i can't really feel like a bad bitch but it's already like four o'clock so yeah i'll see you guys in a little bit i ordered some earrings wow what is this i ordered some earrings from um shein i don't know phases Went from the necklace phase and stuff so now i'm straight into statement earrings so i picked up literally a pair it like this i picked up some of these because everybody always wears them and i don't really like them they're too small i picked up some like tiny green ones like this i didn't want huge ones these are really cute these are giving me very bali i picked up some hoops with some pearls <clears throat> I got these ones and oh these are really cute for end of summer um i don't like these these look cheap they all were cheap but you know it was just risking it and i don't like those either you know i'm gonna show them i got these <clears throat> i got this set of door knockers which looks better than the other ones um i got these little cute circle ones 
I got these hoops with butterflies on them. These are cute, but they look kind of heavy. They might rip my air out. This is cute, geometric. And then I got and I got this pair. Um, I mainly picked them up so that when I film, I have a nice statement piece. And I also got a book. Um, this is my daughter's little sister's mom's book. She wrote a book. So I'll leave the link down below if you guys want to check it out. I'm going to read that as well. Added in my book club. So yeah, I'm going to go film. This battery's dying anyways on time per usual. So I will see you guys afterwards. They want. Oh. oh, there she go. There she go. Wow. Get into wow, there's old Asia. This is the Asia that we've been waiting for, that we've been looking for. So, I just filmed and took some pictures for my comeback for the gram. Ideally, I wouldn't be coming back because I'm kind of enjoying not having an Instagram, but of course, work calls. So, I have to post one last picture for Fashion Nova. Um, and yeah, I wore the earrings because I didn't feel like, t like putting on an outfit, you know hold on i'm trying to like get comfortable i didn't feel like putting on um clothes and like shoes and stuff and having to take like a ootd so i just opted for the earrings and i'm wearing one of the bras that i got from boohoo i just cannot I'm, i'd be too excited to put stuff on and i just paired it with some nude sweatpants from meshki i had these for a while but i'm pretty sure they're still on their site um, so yeah, I'm giving a very melanin, brown skin girl, monochromatic, you know what I'm saying? Like, the black fishes could never. The girls that be black fishing, you can never, okay? Um, so yeah, I took my picture already. I just have to edit them. Um, I just took some standard old pictures in front of a white wall because I just really wanted the earrings to pop out. So I didn't like, like I, at first I did take pictures with the background. I didn't like it. It was too much going on. So I just went up against me my handy dandy old white wall in my house and took the pictures. These earrings are so cute. Every time I put them on, I just uh, gag. So yeah. Hey guys, are you guys happy that I'm back to normal? I swear it's like crazy, right? So yeah, I'm about to change my earrings. Oh, by the way, I put in the Ty Michelle clippings and get in, get into the blunt. Hun honey, honey, do you see this hair? Do you see this weave? She is flourishing. Having long hair just makes me like feel like my old self. Um, ideally, I would have never cut my hair, but because I kept dying it blonde so many times, I had to cut it. I feel like ever since I cut my hair, a lot of my self-confidence went out the window. I don't know why. I feel like my long hair was just like my security blanket almost, if that makes sense. Especially because it took me so long to grow it that I was so proud of it. And, and now it's all gone. But it's okay because we will, we will regrow. And it's nothing that some clippings can't change because look, my hair blend right in. So yeah. I feel super good about myself. I just twisted it back. Um, I did like a little one hand twist because I didn't have anybody to help me and hold it. And yeah, I feel really good about myself today. So, well, right now, because I waited so long to do my makeup. It's, what time is it? I don't even know what time it is. <laughs> it's 8.47, so it took me so long to like get up and finally do my makeup and film and stuff that now I can't enjoy my makeup. Um, but I basically filmed trying all new makeup products that i don't usually use because you guys know I, I don't do a lot of makeup videos because i do the same thing and even though my steps were still the same i just tried all new products to show you how to get like that me but better makeup so yeah that'll be up in a few weeks for you guys um so yeah i think that's it pretty much i'm gonna go downstairs and eat some lasagna real g's moving styles like lasagna you know how long it took me to understand that line but yeah, so I'm going to switch my earrings because I'm not about to go downstairs and look like the queen of extraness, even though I am. But I can't wait to go out and actually wear these. And now I just have so many pairs to choose from. I feel like years ago, I couldn't get into statement earrings because, again, you guys, I always say my face is so fat that I feel like they just didn't do anything for me. And I feel like people love hoops. I hate hoops. Hoops are hideous on me. So I just always was like studs it for me studs it but yeah these are really cute i really like these like i wish i was going on vacation or something so yeah i'm just gonna go eat and let's go let's get it let me change my earrings first though because i just i just feel so good right now i'm looking pretty like just doing all of this to make up the hair it just uh, it be having you like you said what 
To who? Not to me. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Please hold. Hey guys! What's today? Is today Wednesday? No, today's Tuesday. Um, hold on. Making a sharp little turn here. So today is Tuesday. I just ran some errands. I went to the bank to deposit money because I was walking around with bands on me for no reason. So they had to go. I hate carrying cash. I just get really scared. I don't like it. So yeah, I went to the bank to deposit my money. Um, I ran into the mall to return some stuff to Sephora. And I picked up the, I just picked up two chapsticks because I love me a good lip balm. Um, I picked up the Laneige lip balm. You guys know I use the lip sleeping mask. But I picked up the regular one. I have it on so far and I love it. Love the lip balm so I knew I was going to like it anyways. Um, I got the regular rose one. But now that I know that I like it, now I want the other colors. So yeah. And then I just picked up my regular old chapstick that I always wear if I can find it. Which is the rose balm. I love this stuff. It's only $8. I'll leave it linked down below from Amazon for you guys. Um, so good. I love the way it makes my lips look. If you guys ever see like my Instagram pictures and my lips just always look very succulent, very suckable, very pink, very juicy, like they're thriving, I have on that chapstick. It's just so good. Um, so I'm on my way home right now. I went to Target to get Harper the Barbie paint dolls and they didn't have them they were wiped clean so i'm gonna order them on amazon even though they only have the chelsea versions but it's fine she'll just have to wait until they come back in the stock so yeah i'm on my way home so let's just ride out let's just get our music going i'm singing because i'm about to go home and get activated i'm back on my bully so i hopped out my feelings and i hopped in my bag i'm go home and get dressed i'm going to dinner and i'm ready to feel like the old me so was really good to be honest i don't care about your opinion what a chick hi thank you here we go you saw me call you yesterday i'm back on i invested in myself that mean i'm back on all right so i'm home now um it's like five o'clock now 501 so i'm about to sit down and do my makeup and my hair so that me and kylo could go out to eat and get us a drink or seven so i'm gonna do that so i will catch up with you guys when kylo gets here and we'll just go out and have a little friends day and yeah i'm gonna turn on young Dolph because young, young Dolph had me feeling like baby don't let no man trick you out your spot because you are very much that bitch okay that's how young Dolph had me feeling so yeah i'm gonna put on his album and let's just go get cute because right now if I could feel how I felt last night, baby, we might be on to something, okay? <laughs> Worst date award goes to right here. Alright, so me and Kylo. Oh, let me turn the music off. Where's the remote? Where's the remote? Where's the remote? <laughs> Don't copyright me. So, back from dinner, it's like. I don't know what time it is. It's late though. Um, me and Kyla were just hanging out in my house for a little bit. So yeah, I'm about to go take a shower and wash my makeup off and stuff. I already took my hair clips out. So I will see you guys tomorrow. And yeah, I think that's about it. Hello. Hey guys, it's Wednesday, I think today. Um, is it Wednesday? I'm almost sure it's Wednesday. So yeah, today's Wednesday. Um, I've been in bed all day. I woke up early. I went to sleep at like 7 in the morning, don't, don't ask why. I went to sleep at like 7 in the morning, I could not sleep whatsoever. Literally at 5 o'clock in the morning, I was ordering um, the Barbie Reveal dolls for Harper. I got her the big ones from Target's website, and then I got her the Chelsea ones from Amazon. Because I told you guys I went to the store to get them and they were sold out. So yeah, I'm going to just edit those today, and then I'll probably read uh, my books I'm not really into such a fun age right now. I'm going to give it two more chapters. And if I still can't get into it, I'm going to ditch the book. Um, and then I'm going to move on to the supermarket. Because someone did comment on the vlog. The supermarket is really good. And three women. Oh, and someone said leaving time is really good. So, so I'm going to go eat. So let's go downstairs because I'm starving. And yeah, I look crazy. I don't have no earrings on. But at this point, take me for who I am. Period. Period. No. I don't want you. Hey, puppy boy. 
Hey, puppy boy. That's a baby boy. Him is so bad, so spoiled. I'm mad at him. Him is not a good boy. Alright, so I just ate. Is there food in tea? You know, sometimes you eat lasagna. I mean, like the parsley. Is it? No, but not parsley. Oregano and stuff you tea. But yeah, I just ate. I'm so full. And that was actually a very small piece of lasagna. But I am stuffed. But it was so good. It was everything that I needed it to be. My mom makes like the best lasagna. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do when I don't live here. Because who's going to feed me? Now that I'm well fed and hydrated, um, I'm just going to relax a little bit. I wish I had something to watch on TV because like, I do want to watch TV, but I don't. I finished everything. Like, I need to slow down on the binge watching because watching three series, I mean three seasons of a series in two days is disgusting. But yeah, so I'm going to, I think I'm going to start by editing the videos. So I'm going to sit here. Put on my memory cards in, see if I like the footage, stuff like that. Hopefully I do. Um, and then like I said, I'm gonna read come on shirt. I'm gonna read supermarket. I'm gonna try to read two more chapters in this. So yeah. I mean I did already read a book this week, so I'm proud of myself. You guys know I read Jasmine's book. I finished it in a day. Um so yeah, I don't really have much on my agenda and it just started like drizzling. So I think it's gonna rain today in Philly. So all more the reason to lay in the bed hey guys oh my god the air conditioner is so high hey guys what's today i feel like every single beginning of every single clip i'm like what's today because i never know what today is i don't understand why it's always traffic in philadelphia where are y'all going like y'all would think this is la or something it's nowhere to go it's nothing to see it's nowhere to be um yeah it's thursday I'm on my way to pick up Kylo so we can go to the mall. Um, I don't have anything in mind that I want to get. I just want to go to the mall and browse. Um, if they have something that I really want, I'll get it. But I don't I don't have anything on the top of my head right now. So yeah, so we're picking him up. It's traffic. But I'm just going to cut through this city. I can't, I'd rather like take a longer way than to ever just sit in traffic. Like I honestly, I just cannot do it. Like traffic is just so disgusting. Come through. Just us two. I like it cause you can how I'm cut too. Get my teeth done. Cash at me. Sneak dissing on the ground, bitch at me. Alright, so we're in Bottega. Being toxic. I really want that bag and I really want to get it. So let me tell y'all how me and Kylo both bought things in Bottega, but then come to McDonald's and eat off the dollar menu. <laughs> if that's not balance, it is. I don't know what it is because I don't see but it's not even wrong with it. <laughs> I just wanted to make chicken. I love me chicken. I don't know why me chickens aren't like a meal. Like right? Why don't they? Why do they never give me chicken? They act like the shine. They act like chickens are shitty and sh me chickens aren't shitty at, at all. <laughs> Trips to your crib in the middle of the night. Yeah. Cheers. <laughs> mm. Alright, so I hate when I do that. It's 8 o'clock. Now it's 8 13. I'm on my way home. I have to um I have to stop at CVS really quick to pick up something and I'm gonna pick up some Z quill because your girl is not staying until 7 o'clock at night tonight. But yeah, so that was today. Um, I guess you guys will see what I decided on later. I'll show you guys tomorrow after I get my lashes filled. Um, but yeah, I'm super happy with what I got and I am going to buy something else that I didn't show you guys in the segment in the vlog. So you guys will see that soon. Um, but it was just something I need to decide on a colorway for me. But yeah, so today was fun. Had a good time. Very productive day for me. Um, I didn't, I wasn't expecting to get anything. You guys know, but I'm happy with what I got. And I was planning on buying something from Cartier, but they closed while I was in Bottega. So it wasn't meant to be, but that's okay. It's not a big deal. I could just buy it at any time. 
um so yeah i'm on my way home so i will see you guys tomorrow thank you guys so much for tuning in so far and yeah all right hey guys so what's today <laughs> i swear i don't do that on purpose but i literally just never know today um today's friday so i got my lashes done got me a nice little fill my skin just looks always so much more red on camera so what did i do today i woke up pretty early um while my mom was getting her lashes filled i had to shoot some content for a sponsored instagram post um i didn't go through the photos yet i have to do that today but yeah hopefully i like at least one of them to post so i can just fulfill that requirement it's just like a not like a it, it could be any picture but it's just um for that moisturizer i've been using so yeah there's a dog let's let the dog go all right so yeah now that the dog is done so yeah i just did that photo um i went for something like that i usually don't do so i like wear my hair like wet and slicked back and i did like a very minimal makeup so i just looked like natural um and i was rushing to take the picture this morning because i wanted to take the picture while my lashes weren't full like this because i wanted it to be a little on the more natural side um since it was like a skincare product and not just like you could see the skincare product itself but i don't know whatever that was the look i was going for so hopefully i like one of those photos oh let me matter of fact let me make my picture for today live give me one second um so yeah, I just posted my picture for today. So living life on the edge here. Um, I just booked a trip to Miami. So I am going to Miami tomorrow. Um, I have a lot of content that I want to shoot and I just would like to do it somewhere nice. So Miami is as close as I could get. Um, that's not gonna petrify me. I mean, I'm scared to go anywhere, but yeah. So I'm going to Miami tomorrow just for a day or two um and just gonna go shoot some content tan lay by the pool lay by the beach recharge my battery even more than needing this i'm so excited i love miami it's just miami is just different the atmosphere the vibe so i go to miami tomorrow so since i'm going tomorrow i don't want to worry about having to edit anything into the vlog so i'm actually going to end up ending the vlog today unfortunately but there was a lot in today's vlog it's not as long as it usually would be um but yes all right so as i was sitting here like trying to rough pack aka i just pulled things out that i would like to wear and then i put everything on the bed and then i try to make outfits and in the midst of that i realized i didn't show you guys what i got yesterday at the mall so i'm gonna do the unboxing now so this was the shopping bag it's so funny i actually have to text the lady back because she texted me um about my bag um but yeah this is the shopping bag it's super impractical she was telling me like to just carry it like this because all of this will end up ripping and it did end up ripping because i just feel like it looks weird to walk through the mall like you know like how do you carry it and look cool so yeah i did carry it regular and it ripped right here but that's no problem so whole box just up. so you just slide it out and the box has this white covering on it i don't know why but yeah so this is the shoe box it is just this bright green hard plastic with a raised logo my other boxes are not like this um i think it's just this style shoe maybe or this and the other cluted ones um but my sandals come in like a regular brown box so it's like one of those boxes that it fully slides off which i like like i don't know that was like this little detail you know the things you pay for um these shoes were 8.90 i believe the box says they were a thousand and twenty but whatever i don't know i don't know um so this comes with the authenticity card as always in the little envelope hill tax it came with she put the thing in here to like help it stand up um it came with the two dust bags right here and then these dust bags are really heavy and really nice the sticker obviously so what color do you guys think i got when you saw me trying on the same shoe in two different colors a lot of you were telling me on instagram that i bought both but i'm trying this new thing where i tell myself that i don't need doubles of everything um so i talked myself out of one of them so pause the video and let me know down below what color you think i got i'm gonna wait while you do that 
Okay, so the color that I picked was, are you guys ready for this? I picked out the nude. Um, they are so pretty. So the reason that I picked the nude over the black was, oh, sorry. You know, the hiccups always get me. The reason I picked the nude over the black was, I just love the way the nude looked on my skin tone like I felt like it was almost like a not a true nude to my skin tone but very within my family of nudes um I love the way it looked on my foot I love the style of this in nude on my foot the black was very pretty as well um but just because I have so many black shoes because I would consider this almost open toe shoe because it's net like I don't consider this a fall shoe so because I have so many black sandals in general you guys know like I have the Elias, Tom Ford's, YSL's, Alexander Wings so many different pairs of black sandals black toe shoes open toe shoes for me I didn't think I needed them um, as of right now, aka if I like end up really falling in love with these over the next few weeks, I probably will get them. Um, but as of right now, I don't have a tan shoe like this. I only have like three tan heels, I believe. Um, and I don't really wear them that often. So I really did like these. I'm super excited to have these in my collection. So yeah, I opted for the nude because I just like I didn't have a new shoe in my collection. So I'm super excited to have these and yeah i think they're my last shoe that i'm gonna add to my collection this summer um i think after this shoe i'm gonna move on to boots and stuff and i don't really like boots at all actually i only own like three four pairs of boots and two of them are louis vuitton um so yeah that's what i picked up from there so if you guessed nude you were right um it's just sometimes having a lot of black shoes is overkill even though you can't go wrong with a black shoe but it's just like sometimes you can easily talk yourself out of the black and the nude was so different that I just had to get the nude over the black. But like I said, if I really, really like these, um, I'll probably get the black. Because you guys know when I ordered my other ones and I like them so much, I just ordered them in the other color. So it'll probably just take me wearing these a few times for that to happen. But yeah, so that's what I picked up. Um, so I'm going to go finish packing. I'm just going through my closets right now, like I said, and finding stuff that I want to take. Oh, let me pause the TV. Alright, so this is all I pulled out so far. So I just pulled out these bathing suits. Obviously, I don't need all of these because I'm not going for that long. But I got to put looks together. Um, and then I just pulled out some dresses right here. And stuff like that. These are the only shoes I think I'm going to take if I do take all of them. But I think that's what I'm going to try to work with for outfits. Because I haven't worn these on Instagram yet. <laughs> you know me trying to spice it up a little bit. Um, I grabbed my little wooden beach bags and then these are the tops and you guys know like my little visors and stuff so yeah i'm just gonna try on all this stuff really quick to see what i like what it's given hey guys so i was packing but then stephanie kidnapped me to come somewhere with her really quick and now we're drinking and eating what well, we have to be at the airport at what time like eight in the morning and it's eight at night a very spicy of us hey guys so that's my text me sorry so i just finished packing stuff so like one o'clock in the morning i didn't just finish packing i had to um paint my nose because i had to paint my nose because when we went out to eat i don't know some we had like thai lettuce wraps and i think like the sauce on the meat turned my nose yellow so yeah i just packed that's my luggage literally going away for like 50 hours and that's my luggage so yeah my carry-on for me it's just like i wouldn't pack a lot but since i'm going somewhere hot and like with nice photo opportunities i just try to pack stuff that like i can't wear hair and take photos so i mean i only pack like three nighttime outfits and it's like a lot of swim and i just took like to casual office to wear during the day if we go like to the stores or something um because i need to just take some pictures if i don't get around to taking pictures in some of it that's fine but i rather just have a lot of it um and take pictures so yeah and then in my never fool that you guys just saw this on top of my suitcase it's just bags in there but it looks like it's so much stuff because i packed my like wooden bag and that you can't fold or anything obviously so yeah so i'm just gonna get in bed now and edit this vlog oh i had to grab a spoolie for my eyelashes i don't have a spoolie 
need to grab a spoolie. So I'm just going to get in bed and edit this vlog for you guys so you guys can watch it on time as usual on Sunday since I will be in Miami. Um, and yeah, I will see you guys on Wednesday. I have to take the thumbnail photo for Wednesday. That's what I really need to do. But you guys will see another haul on Wednesday. We will be back on Sundays as always. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, please don't forget to like, subscribe, leave me a comment, and follow me on Instagram. Um, talk about a comeback. Talk about a comeback. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much. Love you guys. And sending my love and my positivity to everybody if you are experiencing what I was experiencing a week ago. So yeah, thank you guys so much and see y'all.